Hi, everyone. I'm Sergio, and today we're diving into the world of AI trading. Specifically, I'll guide you through the process of selecting the best AI robot for your investment profile. Now, let's distinguish between robots, signals only, and virtual accounts. I'll demonstrate how to filter robots based on assets, sorting, and types, along with showcasing some exciting new features. Signals only versus virtual accounts. Signals provide insights without real money management, while virtual accounts incorporate specific trading amounts and money management techniques. Now, our journey took an unexpected turn during the testing of the third generation. We explored connecting our virtual accounts to brokerage accounts with our own money. Once released, this will allow you to connect your robots to your brokerage accounts. That's a game changer. Now, let's talk about the features. I'll take you straight to the robots. On our AI trading page, you'll find the AI robots section. Here, the first step is choosing your assets, stocks, forks, or crypto. For this demonstration, I'll focus on stocks. Currently, we have 71 robots for stocks and ETF, 6 for forks, and 10 for crypto. Sorting is, so we are on the screen, is a kind of an important element because if you are a day trader, then the time duration of your trade is going to be short. It's going to be intraday. If you are a swing trader, you then you see time duration or trade duration or being at the trade the amount of time you take for being in the trade kind of moves you the swing trader. It could be from intraday, minutes, 10 minutes, half an hour or like one day, two days, three days and things like that. So for your profile, you have to identify yourself first. Next up is understanding your risk profile. It's not just about drawdown, which is the amount you can lose from your peak. The more risk you take, the more drawdown you allow. So know your risk tolerance. That's what is important. So then when you select all kinds of parameters, so maximum open trades for signals only identifies the following way. So every trade is about $10,000. So that means this account is about $600,000. This is absolute drawdown, which is to the $26,000. What is important also to select profit factor, which is average profit to the average loss. Obviously, it is one. So that means average profit is equal to average loss. Then it doesn't make any sense. They're closer to about 1.5 to the better. So these are the main parameters you have to look at when you are selecting your robot. Sticking with the first generation, you'll notice a crucial choice in building robots, technical analysis, fundamental analysis, or a combination of both. Today, I'll focus on robots created with a blend of technical and fundamental analysis. Now, one of the keys is sorting by average trade duration. This is vital especially if you want to align your trading style with the holding period of the robot. Are you a day trader or a swing trader? Let's find out. You can make this process even faster with shortcuts. We've recently introduced two popular tabs, new for fresh robots and top 10 for the current best performers. Great for those who want quick, reliable choices. For beginners, we've got you covered. Clicking Beginners under the Type tab reveals six robots specifically designed for those starting their trading journey. They offer fewer trades, making it easier for beginners to follow along. Now, the Top 10 tab is precisely what it sounds like, our Top 10 Robots. These cover various analysis types, catering to different preferences. Some rely on technical analysis, others on fundamental analysis and some are a mix of both. Moving on, let's explore the risk categories. Whether you're a high-risk taker or prefer a more conservative approach, you can filter robots based on risk levels. Each comes with its trade-offs, so choose wisely. Here's a cool feature. You can filter robots based on their specialization, like finance, consumer products, IT, and more. It helps you align your portfolio with specific sectors you're interested in. 
Another important filter is the number of trades per day. It's crucial to understand your trading profile. Beginners usually make fewer trades per day, so it's an excellent parameter to consider. Now, let's focus on the top 10 tab again. Clicking on each robot reveals detailed information. You can bookmark, follow, set up notifications, or enable autopilot. Let me break down these options. Bookmarking allows you to save robots in the My Robots tab for easy access. Following is for those who stick with one robot, typically applied to those buying a single robot bundle. Autopilot is a game changer. If you follow multiple robots, it lets you copy trades to your paper trades seamlessly. Speaking of paper trades, it's an excellent practice before venturing into real money trading. We have description. We're making a full disclosure of how we created each robot. There is a lot of techniques we use, and then we really give a good description of what's going on for each robot. There are statistics. These are main statistics which are extracted, and you don't need to go to inside of each robot to really look at what's going on. Now, in order to look inside, you click here, know your details. Clicking on a robot reveals comprehensive details, including open trades, closed trades, pending trades, and more. A new addition is pending orders, providing insight into upcoming robot actions. These are open trades. So that means today the trades will open. Green means we are in a positive. Gray means we are negative, but it's not a big deal. It's supposed to recover. And the red is kind of we should be careful and the stop loss might be soon going to be initiated. Closed trades are all trades which participates in statistics. You see pending orders. That's kind of a new stuff which we just introduced, which allows you to see in advance what robot is supposed to be doing. Now show all stats and now you see this equity line kind of making gains and annualized return, which is important. As I said, maximum open is important. A very straight duration is important and profit factor 1.34, which is kind of a really good from our perspective. Notifications. Don't forget to click here on notifications because you are not going to get notifications if you do not initialize it. Let me introduce you to an exciting new feature, our search tool. If you're looking for robots trading specific stocks like Apple, Google, or Netflix, you can now simply type in the tickers and find robots tailored to your preferences. You can combine up to five tickers and we'll find robots that trade those combinations. It's a fantastic way to personalize your trading experience. Let's talk about our history briefly. Our journey began with a pattern search engine, evolved into real-time pattern recognition, and further advanced with a combination of fundamental and technical analysis through our AI screener and time machine. We responded to your requests for insights into our trading methods and introduced the two-step approach, screening for good stocks and trading them using various strategies, resulting in the creation of our first robots, the signals only. Virtual accounts followed and soon will connect real money to virtual accounts. Now, how can you subscribe? Subscribing to one bundle allows you to follow one robot and we're offering $1.80 in credit for exploration. For those subscribing to bundles, you can follow all robots, plus enjoy a $1.120 monthly credit for various tools on our platform. That concludes our presentation today. Good luck out there, happy trading, and remember, the more you explore and understand, the more confident and successful you'll become. Thank you for joining me today.